Okie dokie. Let's see what dailies we've got today. Again, just gonna tweet out the fact that we're live here. Go here. And click here. There we go. That way I can see chat. Tweeter time. Tweeter. Let me open up this real quick. And that was a Dr. Pepper opening. Let's do it. Alright, we're gonna go chill time tonight. And um, as far as which deck I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use uh, some counter fairies today. Gonna be using some uh, agents. So there we go. Okay. All right, tweet set. Good. So let's close it out. Uh, before I switch decks, though, let me just do a quick duel here. Quick duel with the villains. Not to mention, I really want to make sure. Uh, <clears throat> Master duels, you know, because like yesterday, last stream we had the we had the problem to where like for some reason like uh, Master Duel was having problems like launching us past uh, like actually through to the duels. So I definitely want to make sure <sighs> that's good soda. I want to make sure we can duel here before. I get too, too far invested. Alright. <laughs> oh. Actually had a little bit of condensation here on my desk. Okay. Yeah, cause like, up to this part it was fine, it just wouldn't actually go through to the duel to start stream last time. First? Yeah, we'll gladly go first. Pretty much prefer to go first than most, most all of my decks. Well, I guess not, except for Cyber Dragons. <laughs> I summon Cyber Dragon. Oh, okay. Yeah, it looks good right now. Nice. Okay. Looks like we're good on this one. Hmm, this hand. My, my, this hand. Uh, 30, 44 card deck. I guess we'll try to send Nyuya to the grave. Call it a day. Uh, Nunu. Uh huh. And we're banking on the one solemn. Alright. Alright. We don't got much here. This should be a quick one. Well,. Hopefully it's quick duel. Iris V L. Iris V L. Hm. It's not Veil vale because Veil vale comes with the E first, right? Yeah. Let's see what kind of deck you run. And uh, yeah, sorry, sorry if I got a bit of burps to start this one, but uh, my nephew just fixed me a curl cheese salad. Imperia, hmm, Sprite, are we up against Sprite? 
And, like, uh, we haven't dueled against Sprite once. Once in the festival. So, uh, yes, that'd definitely be a Sprite. A Sprite deck. I had a Sprite to build a trap. So, should I just saw them when they go to Sprite Elf? I mean... This duel's probably over either way, but, uh, maybe I should. Because <laughs> they should Sprite Elf and then try to revive Imperia here, yeah? Yeah, maybe I should. It'll be four grand, but, uh... Mm -hmm. Let me see that Sprite Elf. Oh, that's Gigantic Sprite. Uh, should I solemn that? This card exceeds summon. Push summon on level 2 from your deck. Uh, I really feel like uh, Solomon Sprite Elf is the better play here. Yeah. We'll just, we'll just let that one go through. I know he'll get a uh, level 2 from the deck, but... Uh, excuse me. Yeah, so sorry if I have the burps here, but I'm drinking some soda. But yeah, I honestly feel like Sprite Elf is the better hit. So, maybe that was wrong, we'll see. <laughs> I think really, uh, it probably has it either way, because all I've got is one solid, so... Yeah. I'm going to turn this up for myself, actually. This is Cap Shell. is starter. Uh-huh. That sounds good. Sprite blue. Mm -hmm. Carrot? Yeah. Standard stuff. Mm-hmm. Kalato. Kakorato. So this should be, uh, yeah, the link. There we go. Yeah, this is what I want to solve. Okie dokie. Solum, which meant. That way he can't revive, uh, Imperia to get an extra card. Sacred Beast! Well, I guess these, uh, yeah, there are a few level 2 sacred beasts. That's new. That's refreshing. <laughs> sacred beasts. And a sprite deck. Oh, yeah, yeah, you can make that work. You can make that work. That's honestly not the, the most surprising thing. Sprite Elf again? I would assume. One would gather. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, that's all I was saying. I was just like, yeah, I'm pretty sure they can OTK anyway, but it's all good. So did they take back Imperia? No, Carrot. Well, I guess Carrot is a negate, huh? Yeah, pretty much. Oh, okay. They're... Well, hey, thank you. Like, I'm pretty sure they could have, uh... They wanted to, they could have comboed off for another... You know, another 10 to 15 minutes. But, uh, thank you for making that quick. I honestly do appreciate it. Yeah. Appreciate it. Alright. Turn to menu. Let's just go right back into another duel. Yeah, so we'll do a couple duels with Venoms to start. And then I will switch to an agent deck. Alright, where is my deck? Right there. Again. Looks like we'll be going second, probably. I M A S. Alt S. <laughs> Not a bad hand here, not a bad hand at all. That hero lives. That 
hero deck. Imagine that. Well, I hope they don't put it any in the gates, because we do have Lightning Storm, so that's kind of nice. Um, I guess I should... Oh, yeah, I should check the uh, audio F stream too, while I'm at it. Because this is going to take a while. You got Straddle's first turn, so... Let's see, let's go to my... Let me check the audio. Ferris? Yeah. Liquid Soldier? It's all standard stuff, really. Audio. Check the audio. Ferris? Yeah. Liquid Soldier? It's all standard stuff, really. Check the audio. Yep, audio sounds good. Alright. Do, do, do. What's he doing here? Searching for that poly. This should be uh, Crusader, right? Yeah, Cross Crusader. The usual hero combos. I wonder if they're going to get out DPE. By the end of this Dex Destiny Hero Phoenix Enforcer. Probably. Probably if I was a betting man. Wonder Driver. Hmm, okay. <laughs> yeah, this card does float into something from his hand. So, DPE? That should be DPE. Two uh, Destinies, right? Yeah, this is the Gotta be. Yeah, Destiny Hero. Okay, Nixon Vulsa. Very nice. Mm hmm. Shadow Mist to add, uh, to get to uh, Dark Law, I'm assuming. The Dank Law. Mm hmm, mm hmm, hmm. Setting malicious. They've still got a Mally in the grave, right? No. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sunrise. Yep. That lets you search for Miracle Fusion, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the Mally gets shuffled, basically. Miracle Fusion. IMAS is going ham. Uh, but like I said, so far I don't think any of this negates, so... Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah, this floats, but that's not you know, the end of the world there. Absolute zero! But yeah, some of this isn't in attack mode. I guess that's the problem. But, uh... And that's probably mask chain. Hmm. Interesting. Well, all we want to do here is, uh, must these shotguns mass change? We actually want to force the Dark Law. So, let's, uh, new new here. Yeah, let's force the Dark Law. <laughs> and hopefully they put, uh, hopefully they don't have called by. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you definitely want to force the Dark Law out into attack mode, and then Lightning Storm. Mm-hmm. But yeah, I think this is basically over. They've got a Phoenix Enforcer, so... I don't think there's a way we can get past that, so... Yep, there's the Dark Law. Wow, Dark Law in defense mode? <laughs> That's interesting. Uh, we'll just, uh... I think this is over, so we'll do... Phenomenog like that, finish it. Excuse me. Honest Neos. That's interesting. Standard stuff there. There's the called by. Oh, that's pretty much going to be it. 
I guess we will get credit for destroying some of his cards over here. So why not? Lightning Storm. At least this guy's smart. Like, <laughs> I can't tell you how many times I've seen hero players just put their stuff all in attack mode. It's just like, dude, <laughs> like you're just asking for it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, we'll go with Stealth Burster attack mode. Hell yeah. Let's see if he DPEs that. Battle phase. Alright. We're good, we're good. And we'll set, uh, set two call it a day. I'll probably go after the macro. Both times with DPE, so pop it right now. Pop the macro. You know how it is. Pop it up, it up, it up. Yep, not too much of a chance in this one. We would have needed, like, I guess Raigeki would have done it instead of Lightning Storm. Because, uh, I don't think he had any other... Yeah, the only thing that floated was, uh, Wonder Driver. And that's it, so. Yeah, well, Raigeki instead of Storm, I guess would have been pretty effective, but... And then we could have tried to take, take down the four, four grand, so... See, is that the end of the game? Uh, 5,000? Yeah, I guess it is, yeah. Once again, like, I'm pretty sure he could have crumbled off some more, but I appreciate you making a quick match for him. Alright. Well, there's the hero day. Wow, so we've seen Sprite and Hero today. Two decks, like, like I said, and uh, I've been streaming this the last three or four days. Two decks we haven't seen at all, man. Pretty interesting. But it is the weekend, so... Spider Joe! Take that for what you will. Um... Okay. They won the con toss. We go in first, or we go in second? Probably second. Spider Joe. Doot doot doot. Let me get some more drink. Second. Okay. Good stuff. Alright. Ooh, Snake Rain. Man, if only we had gone first. It was like a perfect. Well, yeah, what, Monster Born? Yeah, this is like a perfect going first hand. Man. We'll see what they've got, though. Cyber Valley! Hmm. Interesting. Cyber Valley. Oh, please set more face downs and don't have a solemn. <laughs> Cyber Valley can um, end the battle phase, though, so that is interesting. New, new, huh? Let's see if we can do this, boys and girls. All right, Harpy's Feather Duster, go. Mm-hmm. Mirror Force? Okay, Overflow, I understand, yeah. Mirror Force, so I guess this is the Cyber Dragon deck. Hmm, okay. Got one Cyber Valley. Repair Plant? Yeah, that's cool. Okay. So let's, uh, let's use Snake Rain. Hopefully, this does not get Ash. Scarred Nunu. Response? Ah, they've got ash. I can just smell it. Yep. Yeah. Yep. That's fine. That's fine. No worries. Hmm. Maybe I should have baited ash with uh, Nunu. But it's okay. Let's see if they've got Max C, too. Alright. Nunu in defense. Darn. Snake Rain got negated. That's okay, though. Okay, do this. We will go with this. And he can't ash the rest of the turn, so that's good. Hmm. Let me think here. So this card is gonna end the battle phase. Well, at least I would assume he would. Um. 
I can use an extra summon here. Let me send Nunu. And he can't ash this, so... Hmm... I could take Kotal. Yeah, I could take Kotal, Reborn. Let's do it, let's do it. Kotal? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Oh, wow. What's really funny is that card has zero attack. If I could have gotten um, a tuner out, I could have actually went into Hydra and destroyed it. Man, that's interesting. Wait, does he have a tuner? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, he has Ash, which is a level three. But this needs a Reptilian tuner, no? Let me see. Yeah, you need a Reptilian tuner, right? Yeah, you do. This is a Reptilian tuner. But I don't have the level 2 non-tuner to go with it. Man, that could have been pretty, pretty funny. Uh, yeah, we'll just reborn and go into... Uh, doesn't really matter. New, new. Yeah, we're we'll reborn. Go into Reptilian. May Lucine. So let's do this. Let's make him use the effect here. Koto, go! It's on you, Spider Joe. Okay. That's what's supposed to happen. And we will go into Reptilian Cine. Wait, could I have gone into Silent Honor Arc there? I mean, I don't think so. Let me check Silent Honor Arc. Did I miss extra damage? Maybe. Um, Silent Honor Arc, let me check. No, 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 because it wasn't special. I was going to say, no, I, I don't think I did. I, I would have thought of that first thing. But uh, All right, over to you, Spider Joe. Luckily, we've got the Solemn in case he... Uh, Tries to power bond or anything. All right. Show me that cyber dragon. Mm-hmm. Emergency. That's fine. This table back. <laughs> Almost scooted the table. Made the take a over. He can give us an emergency at a light machine monster that cannot be normal summon or set. Mm hmm. Tan? Oh, I'm just here there for a second. Yeah, Elatan would screw us really hard. I'm gonna go into Cyber Air. And this sending a uh, hurt at a Nash Theater. is actually pretty good. And you can grab. What are you gonna grab there? Cyber Dragon. No surprise there. How are you gonna special summon Cyber Dragon? Repair. I mean, you can grab another Cyber and Dragon. Don't be far. So there's only. Only one card. Hmm. Galaxy Soldier. Yeah. So you can again. Special summon this. And then, um, he gets to search for. The yeah, right? Into not believe him. I guess I'm. Of course, if he goes into Infinity, I will solve him that, for sure. For sure, for sure. Do, 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 do. Tribute Summon. 
for the other galaxy soldier. Right, right. We know this. We know. Then you go into Nova. Spider Joe. So he's only got one card that we don't know about. Okay. And there's the Nova. Uh-huh. Uh, should I solemn this? No, because it floats, yeah. It floats into any machine from the fusion deck he wants. Which is not good. Special summon a cyber dragon. Okay. Well, what if I lower you to zero? Wait, he's bringing back Nosh there. That's interesting. Okay, we need to use this. Melusin. Nosh there. Hasn't he already used Nashter's effect? I guess we're about to find out. Oh, no, he has not. Okay. Uh, yep. Well, once again, use the effects. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, so Cyber Dragon coming out. Uh huh. Now he should go into a uh, um, Infinity here, yeah. Oh no, at first he's gonna go into Seeger. Okay. Now, should I Solemn Seeger? No, I think Infinity is worse, ultimately. So, Seeger. During the battle phase, this card has not declared an attack. You can target a machine with 2100 or more. That monster gains. Oh, okay. Neither player takes battle damage. Yeah, that's not so bad. That's not so bad at all. It's just uh, an extra damage modifier. You can target one machine. Oh, it can target itself, yeah? <laughs> That's pretty cool. Oh, if this card is not declared an attack. Here comes the infinity. This is what we saw them, boys and girls. Infinity. Yeah. Pretty sure we want to solve them this. Let's see. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Yep. Bye bye. Me, Daddy. Adios, Cyber the Wagon Infinity. <laughs> Is he gonna scoop? Are we going to see the scoop? Oh, he did not scoop. Alrighty. Is he gonna use the effects? Oh, that's not too smart, buddy. Not too smart. Reptilian Melusine. <laughs> Down to zero you go. You gain back to 21. You got limit removal? That's what you would need here. <laughs> In phase, that's what I like to see. Alright. Let's see if we can wrap this up. New new. Very good new new. Okay, so with King of the Pharaoh Imps, we will detach Zoha. What shall we add? It's in the graveyard. Do I have an alien? I do not. However, we could just take Alien Kid. Wait, I could also take a, a level... Okay, so we need the Reptilian, which is a four. Hmm, I just realized I can't really go into Hydra that easily. But I guess we'll take, uh... Nauia? Sure. Nauia! Okay, and we got... One, two, three... Different names. Summon Nauia. Yep. Add Water Lily. Because why not? 
Okay, switch Nelly Cena to attack mode. Use Nunu. Yeah. Use Nunu. Kaboom. Overlay for our second king. Uh -huh. Let me keep track of summons we've done this turn. So we've done three here. We'll go with King of the Pharaoh Imp. See, and I normal summon Nyuya, yeah? Yeah, I did. Okay, so we will detach Nu Nu. And we will add Alien Ammonite. Mm hmm. And I think that may be as much damage as we can get on board. Hang on. So we got Nunu, Zoha, Kotal. Maybe we can finish him this turn. Let's see. Let's go with Nunu. Nunu send. Yes, send Phenomenon. Okay. I'm trying to see if we have five or different names. So we got Phenomenon, Nunu. Zoha and Kotal. So let's send, uh. Yeah, let's send. Let's send Stealth Burster. And we should be able to get the revive effect on. Yeah, special summon. Let's bring out one of our bosses. Phenomenon. Do 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 do. Phenomenon. There we go. Uh, Stealth Burster, sure. Let's use the effect on this. There we go. And this is asking for Zoha, right? Okay. Alright, let's just attack boys and girls. Huh. In case this guy has Honest, let's use a uh, Melusine first. Okay. <laughs> you never know, man. You never know. King of the Ints. King of the Ints. Oh, that was our first win. That went pretty well. But I'm gonna... It's in thing. <laughs> All right, that felt pretty good. All right, sorry, Spider Joe. Looks like you couldn't handle the power of my snakes and their venom. <laughs> All right. Well, that should have gotten us a couple of dailies there. Do 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 do. Maybe some of the missions from the festival. Oh, nice. Yes, yeah, so we've gotten... Oh, nice. We did the 200. No more special summons. Got 15 wins. And 40 duels. Nice. Alright. A lot of gems in this festival. A whole lot. So, that's pretty good. Let's see how many we get in total here. Nice. 200. We'll take it. Alright, pretty good. Let me go to decks here and switch decks. And let's go with... Da, 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 da. Which one has my fairies in it? It's been a while since I edited that. Oh yeah, I think this would be hilarious to run. Venus Reversal Quiz OTK. Yeah, that could potentially be very hilarious. Um... I think... I think this is the... You know what? Maybe I should run this one. <laughs> Let, let's see what's in this deck. <laughs> Alright, so the point of this deck is actually pretty straightforward. Um, you hope to use Reversal Quiz to win. It's not something I can really control. Well, it, actually it is, but uh, what you hope to do is like you're, you have Venus first turn, your opponent like imperms it. And this isn't a once per turn, so you modulate your life points down to 500. You happen to have Black Pendant and Reversal Quiz, and uh, yeah, guess the top card. And you may ask, well, can't really guess the top card in this deck, right? Well, actually, you can. So with Sanctum of Par Parshad, yeah, once per turn, you can target a total of three fairies or counter traps. Place them in any order. So if you use this, you know what the top card of your deck is, if it's a trap or a uh, monster. Oh, that's basically it. Yeah. Been a while since I used this deck, but uh, let me check the trap before I edit this one, though. <laughs> Maybe we'll roll with this one. Let's see. Could be potentially hilarious, so. Oh, 
Okay, everything in chat looks good. Um, yeah, it's been a while since I edited this deck, but one thing I think I might want to do is add some floodgates in here. So let's go with summon limit. Oops, not summon limit terror. Just summon limits. Let's see. Summon limit. I think I have one of this. Yeah, that could be good. Okay, so let's add summon limit. Let's take out one of these cards in the sky. The only reason I have cards in the sky, it's actually not very good, but it does let you dig further in your deck. And it's like when the whole point is to OTK, that's, you know, kind of. Same for extravagance. We don't really want our extra to get banished, but if we have the combo, then, you know, go for it. Uh, also, Time Lord. I think I've gotten some better Time Lords since I've messed with this deck. So let's see, we've got Hyelion and Michion. Hyelion. I think I like this Time Lord better overall. Yeah, Zapion. This spins uh, back row, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think I like uh, Zapion better overall. So look, we'll get rid of Hyelion. Okay. And uh, also I've gotten like Kaiser Coliseum. Does that mess with this deck? Kaiser. Uh, let's, oh, it's Kaiser. I guess Coliseum has one L. It does have one L. Kaiser, yeah. Let's play Kaiser Coliseum. And we'll take out... I'm not even sure why this is in the deck. Limit Impulse. Dude, yeah, I don't know why that's up in here. Speaking of tokens, though, uh... <laughs> you know, if the LTK fails, I guess Scapegoat ain't too bad. Uh, so we'll change Scapegoat for... Do we even need Marshmallow up in here? Probably not. Uh, two Archlord Christia is also, you know, kind of a really good, you know, alternative thing. How many monsters we got in here anyway? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. Okay, that's pretty good. Um, and I only have. Don't I have a better kaiju? I might only have those two. Might be my best ones. Uh, hmm, I could also add a radiant. Um, what's this one? Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. I could add Radiant. Well, no, we got two Kaijus and Sphere Mode. That sh should be good enough, honestly. Um, oh, also looking at my extra. Topo Logic. I've gotten some better fours. I don't, I still don't have access Code Talker, but this one's pretty good if our stuff starts getting banished, yeah. So we'll get rid of Boar Load. Um, three moon. I think I'll switch out one moon for IP Mascarina, just in case we, you know, just in case we don't do the OTK. Uh, what else is in here? Cubit Pitch. Uh, do I really need that in this deck? Probably not. I probably don't need two, uh, all beans either, but I am planning Extravagance, so maybe. Let's take out, uh, let's take out one moon, yeah. Okay, two Hyperion. Two Hyperion. Oh, right, you can't play Instant Fusion. It's definitely been a while since I messed with this one. Let's play Ready Fusion instead. Ready Fusion, uh huh. Because this is a non effect monster, believe it or not. Um, so we got Raigeki, this, one Lightning Storm, Dark Ruler No More. Pretty good. Um, what else? There might be one more Floodgate I want to play in here. Let me see. Band played on. Yeah, and the band played on. I actually really like this Floodgate. It's not even particularly good, but I just find it funny. Yeah, let's play this. And uh, maybe I don't need two fall three Fallen Sanctuary. That's a bit much. Yeah, let's back that down. Okay, let me think here. So we got Venus. Oh yeah, is Mars in this? Usually I put Mars in my Agent Sticks, but we don't really need it in this one. Okay, so we got two Pluto, two Earth, three Venus. I think that's good. 
fairy archers in here kind of weird. Oh, I guess it does do burn damage, so... We have some pseudo burn damage elements, so... Um, and then downbeat is to get us from like a level 4. Like, uh, to get us from this straight to Venus. So there's that. Um, we have three solemn. Okay. Um, one honest. Yeah, maybe we'll roll with this for now. Um, if I think of stuff to tweak in between, you know, to mess with in between, then I will. Um, looking at our synchros here. Hmm. There is probably something that I usually play that... Yeah, there probably is. Um, wait, don't I have two BLS? Hang on. Black Luster. I think I do. Yeah, yeah, I got a second BLS between the time I last played this game. I mean, this deck. So let's switch out... Yeah, maybe we will take out Cupid Pitch. Yeah... Yeah, I like that. Let's switch out one Cupid Pitch for BLS. Yeah, I like that. And I think there is some other cards I usually play in here, but, uh... Hmm. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Maybe I'll change out one kaiju, kaiju, or um, or like one black pendant. Well, no, we kind of want to see both of these, honestly. If all else is going well, um, I kind of do want another kaiju in here though. Uh, let's put radian. Let's take out, yeah. Let's take out one card in the sky. Just one. Yeah. yeah. Let's try that. Let's try that. And maybe I'll take out the other card in the sky. I don't know. There's just so many better draw cards we can be playing that don't, you know, skip our battle phase and prevent special summonings, too. So, uh, yeah, we'll roll with that. Okay. Let me check what time it is. Yeah. 7.49. Okay. All right. And let's change decks. Copy from my deck. Yeah, that's fine. We've rolled with Venoms for a while, so let's copy... Yeah, Venus Reversal Quiz. <laughs> and this is does have the changes I made, yeah? Yeah, I see Radiant in there, so... Select. And there we go. Alright, wish me luck. Interesting first hand. Oh, let's see what they've got. Kira! Oh no, it's Kira. Where's L when you need him? I'll take a potato chip. And eat it! Okay. Enough of that. Uh, two face downs, that's it, huh? Well, we got a kaiju here. Hmm. What should we do with this hand? My, my. Hmm. What's funny is cards from the sky with this combo in Neptune. I could actually search for this, but I only play one of the field spell. Just because you do banish Neptune a lot. Um, let's try Ready Fusion. I guess I'll go into, uh, well, if, if it all works, I guess I'll go into uh, Moon first here. So, yeah, there's all being. Yep, there's that, and let's play the field spell first. See if he's got MST. No? Okay. Well, we'll go into Neptune. Not the uh, ideal first hand, but, you know. And then we will go into the moon. 
And I don't know why I'm doing this, because I, I highly expect this to get bad. But, uh... Let's see... Moon? Yeah... Nope, don't want to ash myself. Uh... Oh, is he actually gonna let me do this? Oh! Well, that turn went a lot better than I thought it would. Or did it? Maybe he's got Magic Cylinder. Alright, attack, Moon. Okie dokie. Don't know what you're up to there, Kira, but, uh... I end my turn. Well, I guess we're about to find out. What you got, Kira? I will become the god of a new world. <laughs> Maybe they're just bluffing. I mean, I guess we're, we're about to find out. The end phase. Hmm. I got two fairies in the grave, yeah? Ooh, black pendant. Cool. Okay, well, we might be able to fully combo... Maybe, maybe not. Let's, uh... Huh. Let's just see if this summon goes through. I'm gonna go with Earth. Uh-huh. And this will let me get Hyperion if he lets me. Nope, don't ash myself. Wow. Okay. So let's grab Master Hyperion. Okay. And, uh, let's, let's actually fire Moon, we can tribute herself, then target a card and destroy it. Well, let's get rid of this card, whatever it is. Um, Krish Orcus, oh boy, that's fun. Uh, let's go into Hyperion. We will banish Neptune from the grave. Kaboom. Evil. That's the Hyperion. Okay. Wait, he's trying to add a... How about we just say no? How about we Ash? Maybe a little preemptive, but I forget how Orcus works, so... Okay, Master Hyperion, get rid of that last face down, buddy. And we will banish Moon, sadly. To do it. Boom. And that was... Tier Elements? What? We've been up against Tier the whole time? Oh. Well, that kind of changes things, but not really. I guess... Let's go into, uh, tier, huh? Oh, I didn't expect that at all. So you're telling me a tier player bricked? It's impossible. Uh, we'll go with <laughs> Master Flare Hyperion here, I guess. Okay, use the effects. We will send Venus to the grave. I guess we'll try to OTK here, boys and girls. Alright, here comes the Shine Ball. Kaboom. Hopefully he does not have Nibiru, because that would just... I would cry, man. Not really, but, you know. Okay. Maybe I should place this one in attack mode. Don't know what I was thinking there. Um, how many fairies do I got in the grave, by the way? One, two, three, four. Wow, I have four exactly. Interesting. Let's roll with the second moon. So he's down to 6,200, huh? Hmm. Alright, well, we'll use moon. Yep. Guess we'll get the other... Yeah, in our hand. Uh, we'll get the other Earth. Okay. So we got 32. I think we can do this, man. So let's go with 
Parsha. Yep, two materials. So we'll do this. Celestial Lord Parsha. And we will discard cards from the sky. Don't I have two Hyperion in this deck? Uh, search for Hyperion. Yeah. Okay, and then we will do this. So I'll banish, uh, I guess, Earth, yeah. Okay. And there we go. Yeah, there we go. Okay. <laughs> the scoop. Hey, we beat, we beat tears in this festival. You know, I'll be quite frank. I never thought I'd be able to say that, but, uh... Hey, they bricked, and our agent's deck beat tears. Sweet. <laughs> That's one for the highlight reel. Nice. <laughs> oh, that feels good. That feels good. All right. <laughs> Let's see here. Let me check on some stuff I got going here. Okay. Yeah, I'm actually, uh, fun fact, uh, if you guys happen to be watching this on the YouTube VOD, you know, a little later today. I'm actually in the process of up uploading Pokemon the trading card game right now. It says it's got, uh, like 14 minutes left on YouTube, so, yeah, look forward to that. Or, uh, yeah, you can check that out if you want. Uh, yeah, that was pretty fun. Oh, well, you beat tears. I guess... It wasn't full tears, it's like tears slash orcus kind of combo. But okay. Alright, well, let's just do another duel. Yeah, it says it's got like 14 minutes left, so it should be premiering on YouTube here in about. Let's see. Here in about. I'd probably give it 8 30 or so. Yeah. Alright. Do -do 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 -do. That was fun. That was fun. Tomo. Okay. And yeah, we'll go first. Hope we get impermed. Hope we get Venus. Imp they imperm us, and we draw reverse quiz and black pin. <laughs> Man, if I pull off the reversal quiz OTK like even once, even once in this. Uh, I'll be so happy. Uh, let's see. Well, Valhalla, but we don't have the best uh, special summon here, do we? I guess I... C hmm. Okay, let's see if they ash this. Valhalla? Yeah, this isn't the best uh, first turn, but... Uh, well, no, no, no. I don't have Sanctuary in the Sky. Darn. Hmm. Wow. Um... I think I still want to do it, though. Yeah. Valhalla? Yeah, I just realized I don't have Sanctuary in the Sky, but you know what? <laughs> it's funny, we drew this combo two duels in a row. It's kind of interesting. Uh, yeah. Hmm, something I just thought of. Instead of, a <laughs> Instead of going for Moon... And for the foolish effect, I could actually two tribute set uh, the kaiju, the mystery dust kaiju, God, God Darla. Should I do it? That might be the ultimate cheese. You know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. So I will tribute set for two right here. <laughs> All right, I ate my turn. <laughs> Unironically, that's probably the best play we could have made. <laughs> I haven't seen someone tribute set, two tribute set, since, uh... It's been a while. Yeah, yeah, he had Lightning Storm, so... Yeah, that was the best play we could have made. You know, oddly enough. That's funny. <laughs> Rhoda, okay, it's a hero deck, most likely. 
show me that Shredos. Oh. Oh no, it's Tear. Uh, now, I know my Venom deck performs horribly against Tear. Um, I'll be completely honest. This one kind of does too. Uh, it's just like Venoms need Graveyard because, and, yeah, and like I said last stream, I'll show one tier duel. Well, I guess we actually won one tier duel. I guess we'll show two tier duels. But yeah, we're definitely probably going to lose this one, and that's okay. But it's just this, the agent deck, you know, assuming the reversal quiz OTK fails, only eight cards in the extra for this tier deck. Interesting. I guess they didn't pull all the usual extra stuff. But, um, like, uh, unlike Venoms, which need, you know, Noon the special summon from the grave. Um, I mean, my tier, my agent deck needs the grave in a different way, you know, because as you saw, like to play Master Hyperion, we need to banish uh, agents from the grave. So, yeah, and if they have like Abyss Dweller and stuff, we can't, you know, we can't do what we want to do. So, interesting. So if they shut off the grave or mess with the grave, yeah, it's kind of a problem for us. So, but yeah. Yeah, pretty interesting to see. Only eight cards in the extra, but... Hey, man, times are tough. Not everybody has the good luck. You know, to pull the perfect 15-card extra deck. I understand, I understand. We still haven't pulled access code, so, you know. Believe me, I understand, Tomo. It's rough out here. Get Kalos? Oh, Ru I'm sorry, Root Kalos. Root Kalos. All right, there goes the mill. I doubt I milled anything good. Oh, I milled the Floodgate. Yeah, this would have been good first turn, but uh, it is what it is. I also milled Raijiki. <laughs> destroyed by a card effect, you can special summon. Yeah, so the best way to get rid of this card is to... Um, Either battle or like a kaiju or something. Or, you know, sphere mode is also kind of good. Hmm. Oddly enough, Tomo did not put up three monsters, though. Or Abyss Dweller. Well, not yet. Not yet. So that is interesting. This may be more of a control uh, tier elements. Whoa! Four face downs against a tier deck? I swear, I've never seen this before. It's maybe like some kind of hybrid build, I don't know. Send it a thunder, huh? That's interesting. Well, maybe we can force him to play an, uh, an extra monster here. Play a send it a thunder right here. Hmm. Do 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 they're thinking. Okay. And I guess we'll take out uh, this. Why not? Shireen. Or how would you say that? Tier elements, she eat in. Change it to face down defense. Oh, okay. Then, uh, okay. Tier elements, meta noise. Interesting. Very interesting. So is this gonna let them fuse and stuff? I still have a normal summon, right? Yeah, I have not. Bum, 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 bum. Well, yeah, they have three monsters on the field now, so... Hmm. We'll see if we can, uh, sphere mode main phase two here. <laughs> Which is quite funny. Okay. Okay. Uh, three fusion. A Lido heart. Wow. Impressive. A Lido heart. Oh, okay. So, Thunder's going bye bye. Very good, very good. Yep, Kaleido heart is very strong. Do -do 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 -do. 
Another fusion. Right, back to Kit Kel. Kidoki. And then they can add from their hand. Well, I guess we'll tribute the three fusions, I guess. If we're allowed to. Main two. Let's give them a present. Yeah! I'll gladly do this. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> and we lose, but uh, there you go. There's your gold nick, boy. <laughs> Dun, 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 dun. Okay, I end my turn. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Alright. And they searched a monster to their hand, so that should be it, but still pretty funny. <laughs> do, 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 do. Scream? That is Scream, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tier Elements Scream. Uh-huh. Bop, 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 bada, bada. Oh, and they had Ash Blossom the whole time, too. Yep. Pretty good. do 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 Mm-hmm. Well, all they need to win is uh, just attack here, so... Pretty straightforward. Linking? Crossy. Hmm. Oh, I guess this does let them special summon from the grave once they go into their fusions. Well, that's interesting. Eight card extra and running cross sheep. That is pretty interesting. Yeah, they get the effect. Okay. I can respect it. I can respect it. That is a, a pretty cute tech that I don't see too many tier players running. So, that's pretty cool. Supreme Sea Mare. Yeah, yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good. Alright. Yeah, I can respect it. Where's my soda? Get Kalos once again. All right, heartbeat. Uh huh. Battle Fox, and that's game. Not bad, Tomo. Not bad. Okay, let me check on that thing I was talking about for YouTube here. One sec, and we'll go back into the duels. Okay. So let's go here, right here. Oh, oh man, my leg itches. I don't know why. Well, then again, I kind of do. Yeah, unfortunately, summertime is here. It's actually a very nice... Uh, uh, May rainy day uh, here where I am at. Um, yeah, it's actually been pouring in the last couple hours, but <laughs> unfortunately the rain's both a blessing and a curse. I mean, it does make it a lot cooler, which is good, but uh, unfortunately, yeah, it makes the mosquitoes really bad around here. So, yeah, wouldn't be surprised if, you know, three or four of them snuck in the house, but do, do, do. All right, looks like my thing, my uh, YouTube video has uh, like two minutes, so we'll do one more duel. 
and then I'll take a slight break, break to uh, post it up over there. Unknown characters, one, two, three. All right. Going seconds. Let's see if we can hard draw these. Although I guess it doesn't matter because we're going second here. Oh, we did. Nice. Yeah, and we never want to see Shining Ball in hand. That is a garment or a breaker or whatever you want to say. Uh, 41 card deck. Tier. Okay. <laughs> see ya, buddy. Congratulations. There's no need for me to... Yeah, no. I did have Ash in hand there, but uh, no. <laughs> Uh, but to be fair, I remember when we started this day one, and I was just like, yeah, maybe we'll see all the tier players once we're uh, level 10 and up. And we are level 11, and we did just see three tier decks in a row, so maybe that's where they're all at, guys, in the festival. They're, <laughs> they're all at 10 and higher. Ferro Monte, Skull Servant profile. All right. Hopefully this won't be tier for the fourth time in a row. That would suck. Okay. 15 card extra. 40 card deck. Um, not much going on here. I think we, we do have a couple interruptions. We've got Ash and Called By, so I think we'll set those two cards. And that'll do it for us. Okay. Let's see what you've got, Pharaoh Monte. Nope. Change this to off real quick. There we go. Okay. What you got, buddy? Hmm. There's one deck I'm thinking of that we haven't seen at all in the tournament, and that is uh, oh, evenly matched. Okay, no problem. And that is um, dinos. We haven't seen dinos at all. Evenly? Show me that evenly matched. That machine it. Yeah. That's fine. Nope. Well, actually, I could have changed. No, no, no. I shouldn't have changed scapegoat there. So I will banish. Called by. Alright, now he should do his normal combos. Interesting that he even bleed for one card there. But, uh. Because normally you want to evenly match for, like, as many cards as possible. But, uh... Whoa! Rockets! Okay. Interesting. Rockets! Hmm. Going into the usual Dragon Link combo. Striker Dragon. Add one Boot Sector launch, huh? What if we negate that? Let's see that called by, buddy. Actually, that called by. Oh. Hmm, okay. Nope, don't play anything. He should still be able to, like, combo off. So he gets back tracer. Okay. He can normal summon and seal though, right? I don't know. Okay. Maybe he can? I don't know. Oh! Okay. Well, looks like we're good. Let's play scapegoat. Somehow we made it past that turn, boys and girls. I don't know how. Cheap token. 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 Alright. Oh. Nice. Let's see what we draw here. <laughs> oh, okay. 
Not what we wanted to see at this point, but that's okay. Max C? Hmm. Maximum C? Well, he does have his, like, whole combo thing online, so... As much as I don't want to give this man three cards, we're probably going to give him three cards. So let's uh, do this. We're just going to go into BLS and that's it. Link of Spider. And then we'll go for... Mascarena. Right here. Alright, BLS it is, boys and girls. We don't have much else, you know, to work with here in the hand, so... Yep, as much as I don't like giving him three cards under Max C, I feel like it's the right thing to do there. There we are. Cool, normal summon honest for the flex. <laughs> and here we go. Now I'm pretty sure Dragon Link can still out this, but uh yeah. turn this to the hand. And I think I'll bluff. I think I'll set, uh... Obviously we can't use Reversal Quiz at this point, but I think I'll bluff and set it face down. And we'll call it a turn. Alrighty. Yeah. Like, seven cards in hand for Dragon Link? I mean, he should out this, honestly, quite easily, but, uh, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> Check my other thing I had going there. What is that? Red Eyes Insights, so that'll let him get the Darkness Metal Dragon, of course. Oh, no, wait, let you get a Red Eyes Spell or Trap. Uh, they do have one that constantly revives, though. Fang with Chain. Hmm, that's interesting. Have we actually been facing the Red Eyes this whole time instead of Dragon Link? I don't know. Looks like Dragon Link to me. <laughs> and they tried searching for Boot Sector Launch, so I, I don't know. I'm pretty sure the Red Eyes is a camouflage. <laughs> I know better. Show me that Dragon Link combo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah strike your Dragon. You know what you say. There ain't no way I'm facing pure Red Eyes. They would have used Red Eyes Fusion like first turn. Uh, let me use this. Okay. And... Okay. Oh, nice. Do, 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 do. Okay, and they should be getting back the, uh... Tracer here, right? Yeah. I'm familiar with this. Okay. Uh -huh. Romulus. Yes, yes, yes. This is all too familiar. Mm 
Uh huh. And they take Ravine. Yep, yep. Yep. Man, if we could have somehow gotten out Christia, I don't know, this guy might have screwed, to be honest. But, uh. Nope. Not to be. Let's see. Okay. Oh! My, uh. Pokemon trading card game video is done. So, yeah. I'm gonna go over to YouTube and post this real quick. Make sure the audio is good and stuff. Don't mind me, Pharaoh Monty. Just working on my YouTube video, buddy. Which you should check out, man. YouTube.com slash Floodmon14 if you guys are so interested. What might be possibly the easiest? Yeah. What I mean by that? Well, this, um... This club metal, and this uh, club, the psychic club, Murray, it basically all depends on what he starts with. If he starts with the tank, it's probably going to be a tough battle. Oh, and it's Shanty. Okay. <laughs> Alright, everything sounds good. Is this game prompting me? Okay, no, no, no. He's still doing combos. World Legacy! Whoa, Guard Dragon. Yeah, that's a pretty good card. Okay, just going to... Tweet this YouTube video out. Do, 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 do. Uh, let me go here. There we go. Share. There we go. Thanks. Best case scenario, this guy times out like a. Uh, I remember some other Dragon Link player we were playing timed out. Because we forced him to combo twice. <laughs> Let's see here. But he should get a Borolo Dragon out here before all is said and done. Yep, hit C. Yep. This is all too familiar. Tempest! I didn't even see he got that out, but that's cool. Alright, there we go. Tweet sense. Alright, yep. Part 41, Pokemon Training Card Game. Heck yeah. There's the red eyes. Overlaying for Flare Metal Dragon. Okay. Flare Metal can't be destroyed by card effects. Uh, each time your opponent activates a card effect, then click 500. Oh, okay. And there's the Triple Burst Dragon. Interesting. You can negate the activation. Huh. What? And target a red eyes normal monster. Oh, okay. Wait, what? This isn't the normal. What is this? Well, I guess it doesn't matter if he's going to like access code talker or something. Or into the Borolo Link 4? Yeah, I guess it doesn't matter. Hmm, weird. Yeah, I normally don't see people playing triple burst. Move it to another one of your main monster zones. Why would he do that? Well, this does point down, to be fair. Weird. Wait, that's it? Um. Okay. Alright, Pharaoh Monty. Doing some unusual stuff, huh? Trying to get me off my game. Um. I guess we'll just, uh, I guess I'll play Earth in Main Phase 2. I thought we were going to get LTK there, but, uh, okay. We'll just go straight to battle, I guess. What is that? Right. Thing with Chain. Uh-huh. Then target one effect monster. Yes. 
What is this dude? Huh. Okay. Now that's fine. Yeah, I think that's fine. Weird. Well, once again, we will try to do this. Um, <laughs> should I banish Red Eyes here? I mean... Oh, you know, that does make sense, yeah. He can become the same attack as me. Or, oh, no, he can use the equip effects. Oh, okay, 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 okay. That's my bad. Yeah, I, I was wondering, I was a little confused why he played that. I was like, wait, what? But then again, it is like pseudo removal, so. Um... Interesting. Well, I think that's it then. I guess we will use Earth. Maybe. Yeah, that was just such a weird import, though. My goodness. But I uh, think what chain does make sense, though. As far as the removal for... <laughs> Darn, we don't have Venus. Wow. He had the Infirm. We had the Reversal Quiz. We just didn't have Venus. And we didn't have... Uh... Black Pendant, either. So close. So, 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 so close. Alright, well, we can still honest this guy if he lets us, which would be pretty hilarious, but... I think that's basically gonna be it. Wow, what a weird inboard, though. I expected more from Dragon Link, but... That was just strange. Okay. Let's see, let me... Close some of the tabs I got open here. Okay. And I got the Pokemons going. Okay. So I will... Let's see here. Minimize that. And I will... Go back to stream here. Okie dokie, and I think we're still live, recording everything, so there we go. Okay. Back to the duels, shall we? Ba -ba -da -da. Okay. Audio and everything still sounds good. All right. Combo round three, absolute treasure. Oh yeah, this is really like we've seen this before. Okay, so it gets back. Ipsy. There it is. Man, I expected this like two turns ago. Alright, so now he'll be able to get his negates up, I'm pretty sure. Okay, this is looking a little more <laughs> familiar for Guard Dragon territory. This is looking a little better. Oh, and he got to use the, the triple burst. Yeah, that is such a weird tech, man.
Alright. I'm pretty sure Savage Dragon can negate this, but uh, let's go for the Honest just because lols. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he can negate it though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> we tried, guys. We tried. We tried. Marlo. Okay. Well, I don't know how we're still in this, but uh Hmm. Cards from the sky. Huh. This is actually pretty interesting. Oh wait, no, no, he's just gonna negate it, right? Warload. Oh yeah, and thing with chain, so we basically lost. <laughs> okay. Yep. Player dragon. Alrighty. Do 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 do. Check. What's going on in the chat here? Okay, we're looking. We're looking good. All right, here we go. Okay. Ooh, well he's going first, and we have a Time Lord. Unfortunately, we drew some floodgates, and we're not going first. Hmm. I wonder if it's tears again. Part of them. Hmm. Interesting. Swords of Revealing Light! Now I activate Swords of Revealing Light, preventing you from attacking for three times. Wow. I must say, I'm impressed. Ooh, Venus. Hmm. Is this like anti tier? What is this? What is this madness? Um, we can play through swords. Let's go with. Let's discard Neptune. Yeah, our deck can play through swords. Let's go with uh, Neptune right here. I mean, Venus right here. Uh huh. Let's start using Venus. Show me that ash, man. Or the maxi or whatever. Alright. Yeah, this is like anti-tier, bro. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Alright, let's start special summoning Mystical Shine Ball. Copies of that. And hopefully the last card in this person's deck isn't Nibiru in their hand. Okay, we'll go with this. Huzzah! Uh-huh. And I don't think it really matters what we send to the grave here, but, uh... Let's just send... The other Pluto? Mm. No, let's send, uh... Fallen Sanctuary here. Monsters that are banished as well as monsters in the grave can't activate their effects. Oh! I didn't think about that. That's my bad. Well, that's okay. We'll still go with uh, this. Yep, two materials. And I'll play it in this zone in case that's imperm. Right. Celestial Night Lord. Oh, yeah. Alrighty. I guess I'll get rid of this. Yeah. We'll try to search for Hyperion. Uh-huh. Alright, Hyperion. 
will banish Pluto. Okay, Pluto can't activate its effect, actually, but uh, that's cool. We get one pop with Hyperion, so let's banish Shine Ball. <laughs> we'll pop uh, Swords, unironically, here. There we go. And I guess... Something I could do here, just to be extra safe, I could go into BLS. Because I don't know what that face down is. Could go into BLS. Yeah, we can't really win this turn anyway. Now, you know what? If all else fails, we can go into uh, Micheon. Main phase 2. So, let's put Black Pendant on... On Venus, actually. Yep, on Venus. There we go. Yeah. Threatening Roar, wow. Alright, well. Maybe now I should go into BLS, huh? That'd be pretty interesting. Hmm. Yeah, Kaiser Coliseum's not gonna do much here. Maybe I should. Yeah, honestly, I feel like this is a pretty good setup. Kaiser Coliseum plus BLS is honestly pretty good. So, well, then again. Now, I kind of want to use Master Hyperion next turn. Let's see if I regret that or not. I, I, I don't think I will, but... Uh, well, it matters if they get hard with the underdog one, really. Oh, thank God. They didn't draw a normal monster. Day of Peace? Wow. Hmm. Well, I can't beat them next turn, so... In phase. Okay. Well, no matter what, they can't take damage. Pot of Extravagance. Hmm. Well, tell you what, boys and girls, let's play Pot of Extravagance right here. Mm-hmm. Nice, nice. That's what all is left in my extra. Ooh, we still got Baron de Fleur and uh, Hyperion, too. Okay. Um, now, one day of peace, can they take effect damage? No, just no damage, period, huh? Okay, let's uh, set Solemn Strike. Let's set Called By. And I can actually search again. I just realized that with... Uh... Maybe I should do this, yeah. Probably shouldn't have set Called By this turn, but... We can search for some stuff here. Ah, that seems like a good idea. Let's search for this. Sanctum of Parsha. Okay, let's get to popping. So I will banish a Shine Bowl. Pop this. Oppressed people. Oh my god, is this guy running huge revolution turbo? That's hilarious. Um... So with the recycle effect, I could take back... Uh, that. But more importantly, I think I want to pop uh, Heart of the Underdog there. Yeah, it just seems seems way too good. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. So let's banish Shine Ball. Pop Heart. Yeah. And then we will pass the turn. That sounds good. Let's pass the turn. All right, now that we got Solemn Strike back in the set, I feel really good. <laughs> well, actually, just seeing that oppressed people, I feel really good. Okay, wow. <laughs> oh, God. Unexpected die. Okay. Let's see if he gets the uh, people running about or United Resistance out. Uh, oppressed people. Okay. Interesting. This has got to be the most interesting <laughs> we've ever seen. 
What is that? Beast King Barbaros? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh man, this guy's kicking up something special, man, I tell you. End phase? Okay, I'd like to see that. Alright. <laughs> My turn? Okay. And we got the other field spell. Nope. Okay, let's, uh, let's use Celestial Lord. Let's ditch this and grab Earth. Nope. Let's see, so we'll take... Actually, I should probably take this. Now that I think about it. No, 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 no. No, I'm on the right track. Let's take Earth. I'm on the right track. I remember how my deck works now. Summon Earth. Uh huh. Use Earth. We will. Nope. We will take. Master Hyperion. Yeah, this should be Jover here. Because, check this out. I still have Majesty, right? After the... Yeah. Yep. I remembered I, I still checked that after Extravagance. So we'll banish these two. I mean, we'll Synchro them. And we will do this. Way over here. Majesty Nope, don't use the effect yet. Okay. Nope. Uh, using this one's effect, Destruction Venus. But no, we just want to have Majesty copy it instead, because that way we'll have three zones. And then we have Majesty go. We'll pay a uh, fat 15, huh? Boom, boom. Boom. We popping off, boys and girls. <laughs> nope. Alright, Shine Ball. Shine Ball. And Shine Ball. And these get returned to the deck. So, nope. Now we want to go for... Oh, and we still had Moon, too. Nice. Okay, so we'll send that and that. Right here. Uh-huh. Moon. Nope. Use moon. Nope. Add to the hand. Yeah. Gimme. Alright, and now we start popping stuff. So let's send this shine ball to the deck. Pop soul drain. Finally. Nope. And we have an agent in the grave, yeah. Okay, then we just start popping this field and whatnot. We will banish this for Master Hyperion. Nope. Use Master Hyperion. And we will banish this. Pop this. CL thrust people. And we get to do this twice per turn. So we will pop Beast King Barbaros. And I will banish this. Uh. Alright. No need to do anything else. We should have this. Okay. Majesty Hyperion. Direct attack. Oh. Master Hyperion. Do, do, do. And Celestial Night Lord Parshath, will you do the honors, my friend? Celestial Parshath Sword. Nice. Man, that was a, such a strange deck. Oh man. I really, 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 really wish we could look at the deck list because they were cooking up something interesting. Part of the underdog oppressed people. Like, <laughs> I wonder if they were really going for the uh, huge revolution. So, if you guys don't know, there's a uh, series of three monsters that use this very specific trap card. It's uh, a 
oppressed people, people running about, and united resistance. And long story short, if you have all three of those, uh, you know, normal monsters on the field, you can use a trap card known as Huge Revolution, which whenever it resolves, um, basically it sends everything in both players' hands and fields to the graveyard, except for those three cards, I think. So, uh, I'm pretty sure that's how it works, but yeah. <laughs> pretty interesting. Uh, anyway, let's just go to the next one. Yep, huge revolution. <laughs> oh, man. Either that or they were cooking up something else with Heart of the Underdog. I mean, you can do some pretty cheesy stuff with Heart of the Underdog. Like, you can even run, um, basically normal pendulums with it. <laughs> Since they are all technically normal monsters and just draw a bunch of cards, you know? We got really, really lucky that he, uh, I mean, he drew Heart of the Underdog first turn, but both, both times he drew. Uh, apparently he did not draw any normal monsters, so, which would have let him keep on drawing, so we got pretty lucky there. Two Christia. Oh, that's kind of, well, well, I like seeing one. Well, ideally we want to go first and have like, uh, uh, the continuous spell that lets us special summon. Uh, what's it called? Oh boy. Herald, huh? Maybe I should ash this. Sure. Show me that code by. Oh yeah, is this tears by the way? Cause some tier decks will run this combo. Ooh yeah, it is. It is. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Not good. Keldo. Well, so far we've only seen the Shizu cards. If we do see tier cards, then I'll... I'll shoot. But for now, we're only seeing... The Shizu cards, so... We'll wait until we see tiers, and then we'll skip. Because this could just be some Ishizu variant, so... <laughs> They're going to shuffle my ash. Okay. I think they're just clicking buttons. In the <laughs> there it is. There's the scoop. Okay. We stopped their main combo with one ash. And they were so salty, they shuffled it back in the deck. All right. <laughs> ash Blossom winning us another game. Thank you. Oh, and we're up to level 12 now. Nice. Okay, well, we made good progress in this stream so far. Let's see if we unlocked any other missions. We did. So now we dueled 45 times. So five more times and we'll be done with that part. All right. There we go. And let me just double check everything here. Do, do, do. Okay. Uh, back to the duels. Do, do, do. That was a quick one. I like that one. <laughs> so I guess I guess we we can say we've beaten Ishizu twice today. That feels good, honestly. Normally, normally my decks don't do, deal well with the Ishizu cards, but hey, today we got them twice, so I call that a win. Oh man, Cyber Dragon Infinity looks like baller, bro. I, I love the. Uh... <laughs> If we ever get that, I'll probably play it. Ooh, Venus! Are we going first? I hope so. Oh, nice, we are. Um, let's use this. Pluto will let a special summon. Okay. Venus is out. Show me that Ash! Ash Blossom? No. Okay. Cool. Well, we've got full combo here, so we'll just kind of do 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 do. Yeah, and what's really funny is normally I don't have this combo. But we actually have Fairy Archer here too. Wow, yeah. Should I normal summon this? Sure. You know what? Normally I never get to do this, so let's just show the combo. Boom. Two K. <laughs> You gotta be kidding me, bro. 
All right, let's go into Moon. I have one fairy in the grave, yes? Well, I have three now, yeah. Okay. All right, Moon. With Moon, we can mill. Hmm, let me think here. We could mill Majesty Hyperion. Let me think, let me think, let me think. So we got five. If I link these two off, we'll have... Hmm. Do I have something that can search Sanctuary in the Sky? I do not. Yarn. We could have gotten Krishy out maybe first turn. Let's just mill a... Let's just mill a Magis Master Hyperion. Just in case. Okay. And we have Parshath here. Treat this as two. Yes. Shine Ball. Pretty good first turn here. Parshath. Hmm. Do, 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 do. And I guess we can. Hmm. Kind of like my kaiju. But we'll get rid of it. For. Yep. Master Hyperion. Yeah. Because we got Pluto in the grave, right? I'm pretty sure we do. Uh, let's place it right here. Yep. Banish Pluto. Use Pluto. Alright, that's gonna be my turn. Yeah, use Pluto. Meow. Okie dokie. Only problem is, with this inboard, we don't have any negation, so... Once again, should I go into BLS? Should I go into BLS? Hmm, you know what? This time I will. This time I will go into BLS. Normally I don't, but uh... I will go into BLS this time, you know what? So we'll use... Yeah, Majesty Master Hyperion. And we'll put BLS right here. There we go. Not something I'd normally do, but uh, we're gonna try it. Alright, your move. How would you even say this? It's spelled like Grace, but with an O. Grosse? Or would it be gross? I don't know. 50 card deck, right? 44, 5, Yeah, 50 card deck. Let's see what you've got, Gross. Gross, eh? Oh! Okay, they had a kaiju anyway. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm a CEO. Yeah. I see. Very good. Oh! Better, honestly. So if they would have tried it, man. <laughs> Ooh, dangers. Wow, yeah, we haven't run into this deck either. Just full on uh, danger OTK. Nice. Yep, so this is an OTK deck. Pretty cool. And there it is, boys and girls. That's a uh, uh, Dragoon Lugia. Alright. Honestly, we did the best we could there. <laughs> I had BLS, they just outed it. With a couple kaijus. Okay. Do do do. Next duel. Boy, the last few duels have been going just. It's been rapid fire, man. Honestly, I kind of like that because that's really just more content. But I mean, me personally, I prefer, you know. Kind of a back and forth. If a duel lasts at least like like eight turns, that's what I prefer, you know. Hmm. Well, we got two cards for the combo. We just need Venus and for them to have an end perm. Interesting. A hero lives. 
What if I ash that? Will you will you get salty? Will you have a cold by? Will thou a scoop? Shall we say? Oh, okay. They still had a uh, Ferris. Is that a royal Ferris? Ooh, that thing's shiny. Awesome. Oh, and they dumped a malicious too, right? Oh, yeah, they did. Wow. Nice. Do, 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 do. Solid soldier. Oh, I'm sorry, increase. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wait, are they playing like 60 card hero? I think they are. So they get 53, 4, 5, 2. Yeah, they're playing 60 card hero. I guess they want to counter Ishizu tier as well. That's the main reason I play 60 card too. Counter of the grass. <laughs> There's really no other reason. <laughs> Aw, oh, they got Stratos anyway. Good for you, good for you. Is that a royal poly? It's a shiny poly. And they have a royal Stratos. Look at that. Man. This person got some nice looking hero cards, man. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Another Mally. Polly, are they going to go into Destiny Hero Phoenix and Porcelain? They might go into Sunriser as well. Nope, this is BP. Defense mode, I would assume. Destiny Hero Phoenix and Porcelain. Yep, defense mode. Okie dokie. Uh huh. This should be the uh, the Link monster. Yes, Cross Crusader. Yeah, we've seen this combo a couple times today. Uh huh. Get back a Destiny Hero monster in the graveyard. Very good. Uh huh. Put Mally back on the deck. Yeah. Then you can go into Sunriser and shuffle your deck. Or you can just use Cross Crusader. Liquid Soldier. Yeah. They've already summoned Stratos, though, so I doubt they'll go into Soldier, but uh, they might be able to get an extra normal summon out here. I don't know. Are they going to go into Decimator? Link 3? No, Link 2. Oh, Wonder Driver. Okay. Yeah, we've seen this one too. This one floats, so. Use the second. Use Malicious for the second time. Mm hmm. And since they got a summon, they can search a Polly. Very good. So they set Polly, and now they all put Polly. Bum, bum, ba da. And just. Okay. Do, 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 do. So they're sending DPE to the graveyard for some reason. I guess so they can revive it? I'm not sure. Liquid Soldier. There's Sunrise. Yeah. Okay. And now Liquid Soldier will let him draw two, discard one. They get Miracle Fusion from Sunrise. I guess they were chain blocking there? I'm not really sure why they did that. But okay. Miracle Fusion. Draw two, discard one. 
Bam, bam. Okie dokie. Miracle fusion. How much you want to bet they already got Super Poly in hand? <laughs> I'd say the chances are pretty good. So they banish Stratos and Cross Crusader for Escurialdo. Did I say that? S Elemental Hero Escuridao. Oh, okay. Interesting. DPE should come back now. Bam, bam, bam. And we ain't really got much here, so. Yep, there's DPE. And they can add a Miracle Fusion back. Well, really, any Fusion card would have. They could have added back there. All right, let's see if we can bait the DPE. Pretty sure we've lost this one, but let's go with Ascended of Thunder here. All right. Aren't you going to use DPE? No. What if I equip Black Pendants onto your monster? What then? What say you? Okay, I'm just curious if this would have worked. So let's uh, let's try reversal quiz, and I'm just gonna guess the top card. I mean, since we we've lost anyway, I wonder if this would have worked because this is just a blind guess. But yeah, we'll activate reversal quiz, and I will guess monster card. Oh, I was right, bro. Wow. So if we would have got the Venus Impermed, I actually would have guessed right there. That's quite interesting. So he gets to take back. Increase. To the Spell and Trap Zone. Alrighty. I end my turn. Very interesting. Do 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 do. Your turn. Uh, let me check what's going on here. Real quick. Just gonna attack. Thank you. Yeah, most people have been like, um, how shall we say? They've been like nicer than normal. You know what I mean? Because a lot of times when people have game on board, they'll just kind of they'll combo and combo even though they don't need to. But it's been, you know, smooth sailing this stream so far, which is honestly really, really, really refreshing, so. Alright. And how long have we been going here? Let me check the time. Uh, wow, right at two hours. Shall I end stream? That's usually when I end stream. Oh. Uh, I'll go for one more. One more. Quillbolt Hedgehog. Oh my, are we going to see Junk Speeder? Yeah, dude, we haven't seen Junk Speeder in... Have we seen Synchrons at all? In this festival? I don't think we have. Are we going to see Junk Speeder for the first time? Hmm. Not a bad. Not, this hand ain't bad at all. We got Kaiju and uh, Sphere Mode. Face down cards. Three face downs. Four face downs. Oh my. How interesting. Well, what if I play something that uh, most face downs can't stop? Eh? What will you think about that? I summon Michion the Time Lord. Yeah, and this is the first Time Lord we've summoned. Yeah, so all the Time Lords, they can be normal summoned without tribute. And uh, usually they have some battle phase related effects. So let's just go straight into the battle phase. Dinomorphia! Oh my. Yeah, we haven't seen this deck either. 
How interesting. Dinomorphia. Hmm. So Dinomorphia is like a fusion deck that uh, uses traps to pay like half of their life points at a time. Pretty interesting stuff. And this is their main one. Uh, yeah, Ken... Ken Trajina is their main one. What's funny is we might be able to win this turn. <laughs> Believe it or not. Uh, just because they pay half their life points so often. Yeah, I might be able to cheese a win here with... Uh, yeah, let's continue the main phase. Oh, I don't have an agent in hand. Oh. Hmm. Anyway, what's the effect of this? Your opponent cannot activate the effects of monsters they control that have attack greater than or equal to your life points. Well, my monster's effect has zero, so... Hmm. Oh, clever, clever. That is a clever card, I must say. What if I were to do this? Or should I kaiju this one? Hang on. During the main phase, they have your points. Hmm. Yeah, because this one can modulate my attack, no? Equal to your life points. Yeah, what if I were to kaiju you, my friend? Bye bye. Uh-huh. Battle phase. Alright, and we attack into Gamma Seal. Very good. Use Michion's effects. So this one um burns the opponent at the end of the battle phase. It will hold their life points, cut their life points in half, so now they'll only have a thousand. Very, very good. Alright, and ideally we want to get them down to about 500, because the Mystical Shine Ball plus Honest will be a very, very, very hilarious finish. So, that's the goal. <laughs> Fossil Dig, yeah. And all of these are dinos, so... Yeah, yeah, I was just saying, uh... It was about, about an hour ago, I was like, man, we haven't seen dinos at all. Well, this is one dino deck, Dino Morphia. Uh, but it, it, it isn't the main one I was thinking of. The one I was thinking of is the one with Ultimate Conductor Tyranno, you know? So... Yep. Oh, it didn't attack into me, huh? Yeah, and all Time Lords, when you normal summon them, they shuffle themselves back into the deck. So, downbeat, huh? I don't think we'll need downbeat. Let's do this. Okay. So, they're at a thousand. Hmm, should I sphere mode them? Yes, I shall. Okay, let's tribute you, you, and you. So I want to force them to play another trap that has their life points. Chicken! There you go, buddy. Have fun with that. <laughs> Have fun with a chicken. There they go. Okay. So they played Shell. Alright, they're down to 500. This is good. Alright, let's end the turn. I guess to be fair, we didn't have to give them Shell, but by going into the battle phase, I guess we scared them enough to use Shell. Which is good. Okay. Ooh, that's not good. Alert. Oh, I might have just handed them the win there, honestly. Uh-huh. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. They're down to 250. Still got two traps down as well. 
All right, show me what you get. I think Honest may be our key to victory here, which would really suck unless they, if they had called by the grave. What are they gonna do? I mean, they have three monsters, they could blink. Oh, just attacking. I'm fine with that. Okay, sphere mode should return here. Okay, uh, sphere mode come here. Hmm. Ooh, Venus, wow. That almost makes me want to change my mind. Well, tell you what we'll do here, boys and girls. We'll do a little insurance policy. So we'll go Neptune. Yeah, we're just going to try to bait out some of the negation that's no doubt down here. Yeah, Venus is a very lucky draw. Okay, Venus, go. Mm-hmm. Okay. So we'll go with Mystical Shine Ball. And we're going to try for it, so... Pretty sure this will work, but Shine Ball, attack this. We'll wait till the damage step. Mm-hmm. Is he gonna play anything is the question. Can pay half? Oh. Okay. So we're down to 125 damage step. Is this gonna work? Honest? Honest? Honest for game? Honest for game? Oh, darn. Darn. Darn, darn, darn. He had something that prevented, uh... <laughs> Prevented battle damage there, but it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, he can go into <laughs> to the fusion monster now. Um, main two, darn man, that would have been funny, bro. Okay, main two. <laughs> oh god. Uh, main two. We can now use Venus, so we're good here. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Ash Blossom! That's going to do nothing against Venus. I guess it did make me pay 500 extra life points, but, uh... Oh, man, that's hilarious. <laughs> he stopped our honest, guys. Alright, Shine Ball from the deck. Yeah. Oh, man. Alright, we'll, we'll try to remove this from the field. Um, okay. What normal traps did they have in the graveyard, anyway? Just alert? Yeah, it looks like it's just alert, so... I don't think we have much to worry about. Venus again. Shine ball from the deck. Man, we were so close. <laughs> oh my god. Torrential tribute. Wow. That's a good call. Mm hmm. That's a very good call, actually. So that's going to destroy everything. Mmm. Well, they got me there. Yep, that's a pretty smart card to play. Yeah, because I was just going to link combo after that, of course. But, uh... Hmm. So now Torrential goes off. Mm-hmm. 
Nicely done. Yep, and then they get there destroyed by card effect effects, so... Pretty smart. Boy, they jibbated me hard right there. So, yep, they're easy of revives. They get another effect, too. And, yeah, Diplos comes back. Well, well. I actually think this is the end of the game, because one of these has an effect to burn us, too. I'm pretty sure. Or to, like, reset one of their normal traps, so... Yeah, there goes Alert once again, so... Wow. Yeah, there's the burn effect. Well, GG, man. I felt like that was a really close one. Battle face. Yep, yep. Not bad. But that was Dinomorphia. It's kind of a refreshing thing then. <laughs> Super poly. <laughs> okay. They want to go into their boss one last time. So they should go into... Yeah. This card once again, yeah. <laughs> Just for the BM. Oh no, Starving Venom Fusion Dragon. Scary. <laughs> Nicely done. Alright. Well, that was Dino Morphia. Okay. Let's do it again. <laughs> that was pretty hilarious, actually. Adam! You cannot fathom the energies. Contained within the mystical Millennium Items. Indeed, indeed I cannot. Alright, let's do it. Ah, this hand is ideal. If only this Divine Punishment was a Solemn, this hand would be ideal. Alright, but let's go with the Valhalla. Valhalla into Christia, first turn. That is just, you know, chef's kiss, man. Chef's kiss. Um, I mean, there's really no reason to set this, but we will, you know, just as a bluff. Alrighty, let's see if they can out Archlord Christia. But yeah, here's Christia, in case you guys don't know. One of the best anti-special summon monsters. Yep, if summoned, da, da, either player can special summon monsters. Right there. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Gozuki. Oh, wow, zombies. Zombies special summon a lot. We might have this, boys and girls. I don't know. We'll see. They might have some spells and traps. Ooh. Yeah, Necro Banshee. Changes stuff to zombies. There are some cards in zo zombie decks that, like, once you change stuff to zombies, they can start stealing stuff, so... Yeah, I don't know. Oh, and they toss glow up bloom. Nice. Very nice. Eh? Glow up bloom will let them search for a level 5 or higher zombie. There's some pretty darn good ones. Baylor Drotch. Jackalope. Okay. Oh, they sent Mudora. Wow. Okay. Sent Ash. They sent Baylor Drudge. Man, they're emptying their whole hand. Holy crap. In phase? Oh, in phase. Does this card have an effect when it's destroyed? When sent to the graveyard, you can banish. Oh. Okay. Alrighty, let's go with. Uh, just for the BM, let's go with Mystical Shine Ball in attack mode. <laughs> Response? 
no response. All right, Christia, attack. What's nice about Christia is they can't uh, yeah, they can't kaiju it either because kaiju's are special summons. They can't like lava golem, you know. The main thing you got to worry about, I guess, is sphere mode. But you know that's that's not too much to worry about. They did get to fill their grave. I'm surprised they didn't use the effect of Mudora, but uh, to mill because zombies love having stuff in the graveyard. But uh, yeah. I end my turn, Fathom. What do you got? I would have loved if we got Sanctuary in the Sky there. Because that way, uh, Divine Punishment would have been turned online. But yeah, if he breaks Christia somehow, then I think he's looking pretty good. You know, he's still playing it out, so. Ooh, yes. Yes, yeah, Solemn Judgment. That's what we like to see. Okay, let's go with Honest. In attack mode. Okay. Response. No response. Okay, we'll set this. Do I have gain? 28. Uh, 39. Almost. Here, mercy. Um, let's attack with honest. Oh my god, that works. It was Necroir Old Danchi. Holy crap. So we get a direct hit with Christian. Um, I will return Honest to my hand, though, at the end of the turn. Just to make sure we don't get spear mode. Main phase 2. And then next turn, we can Raigeki. Use the effect of Honest. Oh, we should have this, boys and girls. We should have this. And we got Solemn. Oh, it, it feels good. Get floodgated, man. Get floodgated by my Christia. Alright, if you got a Raigeki or something, let's see it, Fathom. Let's see it. I do like their avatar, though. Very cool. Let's see it. You gotta do something. Target one set, spell or trap, destroy it. Hmm. Well, they got lucky and targeted Solemn, so... Okay. Might as well, bro. Might as well. Go for it. Galaxy Cyclone. Yeah, we haven't seen that at all so far in the festival. Good hit, though. Good hit. I commend you, Fathom. I commend you. What have you now, sir? Another face down monster. Very well. Down to one card in hand. But let's end this duel with a splash, shall we? Ooh, Guardian Ariadne. Uh, Guardian Ariad Ariadne. Let's just wrap this up, shall we? Thunderbolt! I activate Raigeki. This destroys your monster. Jackalope! Okay. <laughs> and we will. Pendulum, activate this. Oh, the scoop! There's the scoop, boys. There's the scoop, boys and girls. Well, that's what, ideally what we want to see. That's ideally what we want to see. Yeah, Archlord Christia, shut him down. Archlord Christia, Valhalla, and like, like I said, a solemn or some kind of negate. That was fun. Yep. If we don't see the reversal quiz stuff, that's what we want to see. Just some pure lockdown. Okay, looks like we activated a hundred spells and traps. Nice. So we got that hundred gems. We are doing good. We're clearing some of these out finally. All right. Yeah, some of the world championships. So the ones we have left are win six more duels because you have to win twenty-five, and then just one more duel. So we've we've only got one more duel for this reward. So I think we will just. Uh, We'll duel. What time are we in? in stream. Let me check my page here. Looks like we've been streaming, yeah, two hours and 20 minutes. I think maybe we'll duel just one more time. And then we'll call it good for stream for tonight. So let's do it. Let's do it, guys. Let's do it, everyone. All right, wish me luck. One more duel. We'll call it a night. Oh. Oh man, I'm gonna stretch a little bit.
Oh boy. There we go. Okay. Alright, are we going first? Oh, they won. You're here! Oh, we are going first. Okay. Let's see what we've got here. Okay, we got quiz, extravagance. Hmm. Maybe we could get the combo. Pot of extravagance first. This is the most draw power we've seen so far. Pretty interesting. Let's see. Oh, they had Ash. Well, that's going to be the game. <laughs> Unfortunately. My hand is all, uh, yeah. All right, you win that one. <laughs> Let's see what I banish, though. Topologic. That's actually a really good banish for us, because we still left. Yeah, we left one all vein. We left, uh, oh, dude, is this Numeron OTK? It is, OK. Well, this will be a quick one. We won't, we won't count this as the last duel because this is just, it's just going to be so quick. It's not even funny. So. Okie dokie. And they're going to send Numeron calling. Hmm. This has been, had been an MST instead of Duster. No, no, he searched it twice, right? Yeah, maybe we could have held on there, but I don't know. Uh... Can only use it once per turn. Interesting. So does that mean if you MST it, uh, you can't use it again? Oh, you can activate the other one, but you can't resolve it. What's he doing? Mega cops. Oh, I guess I don't have a monster on board. I didn't even think of that. I guess we won't be getting OTK. Gee, I didn't even think of that. It just happens so often that, like, <laughs> most of the time, you know what I mean? When I see Numerons, it's just, like, automatically over, so I'm like, what? Uh, we do have a Kaiju, though, funnily enough. Uh, yeah. Hmm. Okay. Uh-huh. Well, all right. We're still gaming, I guess. Fairy Archer. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll try this, boys and girls. Let's activate Cart from the Sky. Activate. Okay. I'm gonna ash this too. They're thinking. Oh, okay. So. Banish Fairy Archer, draw two. Draw our own Ash. Okay. Wow, we actually got the combo. Black Pendant and uh, Reversal Quiz right here. Mmm. No way, bro. Um. Oh, I messed up. Yeah, I forget you can't Kaiju if. Uh... Hmm. Maybe we just do this? Maybe. Now they can still use this effect, though, I'm pretty sure. Eh, we'll just pass. <laughs> hmm. Wow. Does this effect let you... Well, let me read Numeron Calling. That's what I need to read. Are you allowed to use this if, uh... You've got monsters in your zone. Oh, and you control no monsters. Interesting. Oh. Yeah, I guess this was over regardless, I guess. Interesting. Well, no. Although, if I had Kaiju that... No, no, but he had Planet Pathfinder. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so either way, we were... That was one, like, I really couldn't do anything about it one way or the other. Because even if I had Kaiju, like, all he had to do was Planet Pathfinder. We would have took the 300 from, uh, the Dust Kaiju. Or the Dust Kaiju would have got us down to 300 life points. 
and then yeah, Pathfinder for the other uh, the other thousand there. Wow. Okay, that was a quick one though. We're not gonna count that one. <laughs> one more real, you know. It's over in like two turns. Boy, well, if it's over in two turns, I'm fine with that. But at the speed of Numerons, no, I'm not gonna do that. I'll try to show one more real. <laughs> All right. Hmm, no Venus. You're cold. Okay. Hmm. This hand is pretty bad, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, if we had Venus, we'd be looking good. But uh, yeah, all monsters? Whew, that is rough. Alright, Earth, you're up. You're up, girl. What you got? Show me that ash. Oh. Oh, I just thought I could search for... Hmm. Hmm. Wow, we are so close to full combo, actually. So I could search for this. Special Summon Venus. Hmm. Let me just try here. Let me try and see if I can do a pretty unusual combo for this deck. Uh-huh. Then we use this effect. Special Summon Venus. Is Venus a tuner? I guess we're about to find out. It is a tuner. Okay. Hmm. So close. So close. Uh, so we've got one card in the grave. We're trying to we can get, uh, we get four fairies in the grave. Exactly? If we can get four exactly in the grave, I can actually use Christia's uh, Inherit Special Summon ability. Wait, wait, wait. This is going to let me mill, right? Oh my god. Did I actually do it? Did I unbrick our hand? Let's see. And assuming the meal goes through. Send Hyperia? Dude. God. Dude. Nice. So let's special summon Christia. Use the effect. And we will add. Master Hyperion. Okay, and my turn, Yor Yorkle. <laughs> Dude, how did I do that? Oh man, somehow I unbricked my hand when we had nothing but monsters. Okay, show me the lightning storm. Or Raigeki. Or evenly matched or whatever. I can't believe I... Well, that might let him find it. Two, five, seven. A normal card deck. Let's see if they drew the out. There's a good chance they did. They did just draw two, so... I'm waiting, York. They permanent real. Are you serious right now? I'm gonna say I have two. Oh, Fluanda. Well, Fluanda. I I know is pretty consistent, but um, this deck right here is even more consistent. I'd argue. Yep, and there's Penguin. So... And, wow. about that? We'll just... And by the way, it's all under, uh... Knowledge, which means I can't search summon. I started with experience. Battle phase. Wait, why couldn't I honestly... Wait, why couldn't I honest? I'm not so sure why I can honest there, but uh Okay. Let me see here. Well Hmm, I think we have to let him use the effect again. Basically Hmm, let me think here. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can't really bring out 
So I basically have to let him take out Chris Chia, unfortunately. She goes back on top of my deck due to its own effects. And now we will do this. So we'll go with Master Hyperion. Uh -huh. Shall I use the search effects? Yes, I shall. Because now I have only two fairies in the grave, so. Okay. And. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's my bad. I should have played Hyperion in defense mode. Yeah, that is my bad. Um, activate this. And I forgot this was a floodgate, man. That's my bad. That is totally my bad. Okay, one the turn. Of course, I was gonna pop dimensional fissure and the map there, but I threw this one. <laughs> that is my bad. I guess I could have also popped this, but uh, uh hmm, yeah, because this is one of the few flu cards that doesn't recycle itself if it's banished, so. Yeah, that's my bad. Sorry about that. Let's check what's going on here. Do, 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 do. The Wanderies and Stree STR. Finally, that one banishes stuff from the graveyard. Uh, this card's still pretty good, yeah. Mm-hmm. So now you can conduct up to three normal summons or say, so. yeah, that is that is crazy. Not just one, so yeah, they can really, really pop off here, so. Doo -doo. Bow, 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 bow. Oakley Dokley. There's the Ryza. Okay, so they'll probably Ryza and spin my two cards here. Yeah. Oh, that is not Ryza. It is Apex Avion. Okay. This is a free negate, though. Yeah, because, uh, once for chain, you can. Yeah, target a Mist Valley. It, but this is a Miss Belly card, so there you go. But let's do the Wanderies. That's the first time we've seen them in the festival. Uh, thank god. <laughs> uh, hey god, I'll be right back. <laughs> it's that big. <laughs> Alrighty. All right, last duel for me, and then we're gonna end stream. Do 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 do. Soul Gito. Hmm. Interesting. Do 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 do. Second, huh? All right. Man, yeah, I can't believe I unbricked that hand, though. That was just... 
that was just something I just kind of was like, well, maybe if I get Pluto, you know. Hmm. Well, we got Valhalla, but we're not going first, so. Sphere mode, though, is killing second. Guys. Cards of the stone. Select one, two cards. Then you can send in one that will get a card. Red eyes. So it's like beer or something? It runs. Or maybe a two dice combo? Very thing. Table. Some kind of the variant? Draw a card. So, other support cards? That would be interesting, actually. Well, you can only activate one of these per turn. Maybe not, but. Uh huh. Into red eyes. Toon. Toon deck? Or like a some kind of Exodia deck? I am curious. And they didn't search for Toon Kingdom, so. Which I would think would be the main search target. Curious, Sojito. Let's check the extra deck. Four. Four cards in the extra. Extra. Red Eyes in Extravagance, so. This deck is quite interesting. Uh huh. Then add a Red Eyes Spell or Trap from your deck to your hand so they can take, uh. Red Eyes Burn. Okay. So they set Red Eyes Burn. I'm guessing. Interesting. Hmm. Maybe this is some kind of OTK deck, but of course they can't attack on their first turn, so they didn't OTK. Um. Let's just go for Extravagance. Pretty hard deck, though. Like, there's cards in their deck. Crap. First turn? Well, and lower. So we got him to floor uh, with. Does it even matter? No, it's a. Uh, yeah, it doesn't matter. Let's go with a thunder. Just for some extra damage. Mm -hmm. There we go. Let's normal summon Onyx. Um, wait, what can I link to? Mascarina? <laughs> yeah, like I'm gonna do that. Uh, black Pendants. Of thunder, mm -hmm. and let's just attack here. Attack questions later. Okay, oh, that went fine. Two well, bounce off. Guess I'll at Fallen Sanctuary right here, and yeah, let's face it now. We got you, we got the ball. Okay. Unfortunately, we've got no fairies in Grave to uh, be able to use the negated effect of uh, Fallen Sanctuary. But that is the first time I've drawn this uh, since we've been playing Agents. Well, we actually haven't needed it, which is surprising. Not yet. Huh. Show me that Duster. Cards of the Red Storm. So yeah, he's drawing some more. Wow. Yeah, this really makes me think this is some kind of Exodia deck, man. I'm not, I haven't seen this much drawing out of a Red Eyes deck, like, ever, ever, ever. Well, we'll see. I mean, maybe it's just pure Red Eyes combo, and I'm just... They've got some new cards I'm not too aware of. But what pure Red Eyes deck would only run four cards in the extra? Dark World Dealings? Okay, okay, I'm officially convinced. This is Exodia now. I'm like, that, that convinced me a thousand percent. A thousand percent. Um, let's get rid of Sphere Mode? No, let's get rid of Michion, yeah. Let's get rid of Michion. Yeah, that Dark World Dealings convinced me 100%. This is like some kind of Exodia deck. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Allure of Darkness, okay. Okay. <laughs> well... Uh well, I'll give you this. This is the most unique Exodia engine I've seen. Yeah, because why would you banish Darkness Metal Dragon? That makes zero sense, bro. Yeah, this has got to be some kind of special. Huh? Mm -hmm. Ooh. Hmm. Well, I like to do it, but let's say something to all ass shit. What is that? Ooh, is that red eye? What if 
I ash that, buddy? What then? The play It's nice. That works. And you can only play red eye. Yep. Okay. What's next, Sojiro? <laughs> Do we need ash time? Uh, because things fall into ash to negate the wind. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's enough light, so. That's a uh, pretty funny game. Wow. I really, really wish they let you look at the decks in the World Championship. I just really want to see, like, and what was that guy? He was cooking something. You could tell he was cooking something special, man, with all those draw cards. Oh, uh, man. You know, you, know, you know what? Maybe he was playing Red Eyes, and all those are basically to dig for Red Eyes Fusion, number one. And then, I don't know, it was crazy. Uh, but yeah, that's going to... Uh, <laughs> oh, man, that was awesome. He, he let us draw into our negate. I just, man, that feels pretty good. But uh, yeah, I think I'm going to end stream there. And for the uh, for the YouTube audience, uh, yeah, you guys have a good night. And uh, yeah, uh, yeah, feel free to follow us over on Twitch. Uh, same for Twitch. Free field, uh, you know, subscribe to us on YouTube. I appreciate everyone for joining. And uh, yeah, you guys all have a good night. Bye bye, and I will see you all next time. All right. Man, that was nuts. <laughs> Do play like three Dark World dealing, three uh, Red Eyes Insight, man. That was nuts. <laughs>